I vividly remember first having symptoms when I was 13. I started you know, having really bad pain, um, lots of bleeding, diarrhea, vomiting, and they did MRI, CT tests to kind of rule everything out and they didn't really see anything obvious, so they referred me to a gastroenterologist. I went through, did colonoscopy, endoscopy, and they had diagnosed me with ulcerative colitis. He put me on an anti-TNF, and it worked for nine months, and those nine months were great, but then it stopped working. So we tried another one, and we kept going through this cycle. Every eight to 10 months, it would work, and then it'd fail. Eventually, we tried chemotherapy and 6MP, and just a variety of other things, and all of them failed consecutively. And then it got to a point it was so bad, senior year, that we were you know, seriously considering taking my colon out, and that's when we got introduced to the POCAM. So he introduced the PillCam as an option just to look for any inflammation at all in the small intestine where you normally can't see it in an endoscope or a colonoscope. I honestly thought it was the coolest thing ever. So the procedure itself was extremely simple, way easier than an MRI and infinitely easier than scopes. And what he saw was inflammation where it normally wasn't before. So that told him that this was Crohn's disease. It wasn't ulcerative colitis this whole time. So he said, you know what, we're gonna nix the surgery, you're keeping your colon, it's the best thing that we can do for you right now. If somebody asked me if they should take the PillCam test, I would say yes without skipping a beat. 